Hey, Shorex here. This time with the statistics and the unique loot from 500 tool breach stones. I saw that the breach stone prices were really low and the amulet from tool was still at 3x, so I thought, well, let's give it a try. Now, let's start with the loot. I got 251 blessing of tool, 144 tool born, which is the one that's not worth a lot, but you can still sell them for splinters. I also got 69 the snowblind grace, which can be worth a few chaos, depending on the worlds after you use the blessing on them to get a perfect form. I won't include them in this statistic as an income because it's completely random, but I was able to sell a few of them for 10 to 50 chaos. Now let's get to the important part, the Halkian, which is the amulet that can be upgraded to the Pandemonius. I got exactly 30 amulets, which as I said were worth 3 to 4x depending on the roles. But I counted them all as 3x since I personally corrupted them, but that's not part of the statistics. So let's do the math on the profit I made with 3x per amulet. Overall I got 14,850 chaos for the Halkian alone. And I paid 6,724 chaos for 500 stones. Which means I made 8,126 chaos profit. Now let's look at how much I made per hour. I made a little more than 16 chaos per breach stone as profit. And each run took me roughly 3 minutes and 30 seconds. And I was able to run about 17 stones per hour. Which means I got a decent 276 chaos on average per hour on a map that can be done by nearly every build and without any differences in the speed of your build. The only thing that could be different is how fast you kill bosses. One question now is, is it worth to farm breach stones? Well, at the moment it definitely is. But this changes a lot during the league, so try to keep an eye on breach stones and the matching amulet to see if you can make profit with them. That's it for this video, see you on the next one.